Hello everybody and welcome to SnackTube. Now everyone knows that I like big nuts and I like them in my mouth, which is why I bought a Reese's Nut Rageous Bar. Ah, uh, this is king size as well. King size, king size for a king. That's right, that's me. Okay, so this is a new bar, maybe an old bar from Reese's. It's one I've not seen before. I cannot for the life of me remember where I bought this. In a shop somewhere maybe? I honestly cannot remember, but it looked good because look at all those nuts. Mm-mm. I love anything with peanuts in it. So this is their Reese's Nutrageous and it's got crunchy peanuts, peanut butter, creamy caramel covered with chocolate flavour coating. Chocolate flavour coating. So it's not chocolate coating, it's chocolate flavour coating. Right, okay. Um, and see it's been enlarged for detail, the picture apparently. So this sounds like it's going to be very, very tasty. I quite like Reese's. Um, they've got a few different bars that have like nuts and things in them as well rather than just being the cups. The cup pieces, um, the Reese's peanut butter cups, I can sort of take them or leave them to be honest, but when you put proper nuts in a bar, I'm on board. This is an 87 gram slab, it is quite heavy. Uh, so let's have a wee look at this bad boy. I think this is an American chocolate bar, I'm not 100% sure. It does say manufactured in the United States of America by the Hershey Company. So this says um, made in America, imported by Euro Food Brands Limited, which is in Northampton. So it is for sale in the British market, rather than being a proper import that we don't get here. Uh, so yeah. Let's have a wee look. What have we got? Crunchy peanuts, peanut butter, creamy caramel covered with chocolate flavour coating. I wonder what it is that makes it chocolate flavour coating rather than chocolate coating. Um, I don't know. I can't tell from just reading the ingredients. I'm not, I don't know enough about chocolate. Maybe we should go to askhershey.com because that's where you can have your questions or comments. We should find out what that means maybe. All right. Let's go through our nutritional information. This is an 87 gram bar. This is your nutritional information, typical values per 100 grams. So everything in this won't be that far off what you're getting for the whole thing. So energy, 513 calories. So yeah, it's about 400 calories for this one chocolate bar. That's Brutal. <laughs> uh, wow. Total fat, 30.2 grams of which 9.9 .9 grams saturates. 54.8 grams of carbs. 44.7 grams of that sugar. Protein, 12 grams and 0.39 grams of salt. So a lot of fat, a lot of carbs and a lot of calories. Great. Doesn't matter. I'm going to eat the whole thing anyway. All right. I'll show you. I mean, there's the list of ingredients. Don't know if you'll be able to really read them, but there's a lot of them. A lot of artificial stuff. Produced from genetically modified sugar beets, corn, and soya beans. Ooh. Right, let's bust this bad boy open. I want to see it. I want to see what it looks like. Oh, the caramel's escaping. <clears throat> Ooh, howdy. That is a big bar. That is a big bar. It reminds me of an O. Henry. Don't know if you've ever had an O. Henry bar. You get them in Canada. Don't know about America. I'm assuming you get them in America as well. But an O. Henry, it's sort of peanuts. I think it's. I don't think it's got wafer or anything in the middle. It's literally just like peanuts and chocolate. But it kind of looks like one of those. Chocolate doesn't look chocolatey. It looks a bit dusty, which makes it look not as appetizing. But that's American chocolate for you. All right. Let's give it a try then. So this is Reese's Nutrageous. Let's uh, give it the old taste there, shall we? Mm -mm -mm -mm. Caramel is very sugary. Right, let's do it. Try not to get this caramel over my, over my face. There's your insides. Hmm. Hmm. 
interesting. I have to say, I'm not a fan of the feel of that chocolate flavoured coating. It doesn't feel like chocolate, it doesn't feel right. Um, but, this is quite nice. Um, not overly chocolatey. Right. You can tell that's not real chocolate. It's got like a artificial, uh, artificial, what do you call it? Sweetener, artificial sweetener kind of taste to it. Which, I don't mind normally, because you get that in like Pepsi Max and stuff. Pepsi Max, Simon Barrett, that kind of stuff I drink, so. I'm not totally opposed to it, but it's weird in a chocolate bar. Um, the peanut butter kind of gets lost in there because of all the other stuff going on. Because you got the caramel, it's quite sticky. Got a weird artificial flavoured taste in chocolate. And the nuts, the peanut butter, Kind of gets lost. But it's the same stuff they put inside the peanut butter cups. Which is okay. The nuts are fine. The peanuts are crunchy. They're alright. <clears throat> I find the more I'm eating this, the more I'm beginning not to like it. And it's that chocolate stuff, whatever it is, that's going on with that chocolate, it's not, doesn't taste right, it's not milky, it really really does taste artificial, and that might be coming from the peanut butter as well to be fair, because that peanut butter stuff is a bit naff. Hmm. That's okay. I've had nicer chocolate bars for sure. Um, the chocolate isn't very nice. After a while, I can. I'm really starting to see why I don't. Why it's not that good. Um, the more I eat that, the more that chocolate gets disgusting. Give me real milk chocolate, like Cadbury's milk chocolate or something. I will go to town and I will keep eating and eating until I force myself to stop. Uh, but that, yeah, I could stop eating that now and I wouldn't be bothered. I like that it's got nuts in it. The caramel doesn't even taste that caramelly. It just tastes like sugar, like pure sugar. So this, this ends up just tasting like artificial sweetener and sugar at the same time. <coughs> Without any real flavours to it. There's no... The nuts aren't that nutty tasting. The peanut butter isn't particularly peanut buttery. Because it's not real peanut butter, right? It's like peanut butter mixed with powdered sugar or something. It's whatever they put in Reese's peanut butter cups. It's not... It doesn't taste like good peanut butter. Overall, it does, it does taste... tastes really cheap. Really, really cheap. It tastes like cheap chocolate, cheap ingredients. And coming from a proper brand like Reese's, I expect more, to be honest. Cheap tasting, not very nice. Well, that'll do for today. Thanks very much for watching. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, hit the bell to get notifications. And I've reviewed a few other Reese's things on the channel as well. I'll probably put some links in the cards, but... Uh, yeah, just head on the channel and watch some more videos. I'd really like it if you would do that because all the views matter. Every view counts. So, yeah.
that'll do. Thanks very much, and I will catch you in the next video. See you then.